I'm here with Anna Ross Davis at Your Horse Life. Thank you very much for taking the time out to talk to us. Um, firstly, what's the best piece of advice you've ever been given? Um, to uh, do as you're told is my best piece of advice. Find someone you trust and do as you're told. Brilliant. And what's the typical routine for one of your horses? Uh, my horses tend to school about four times a week. They hack and they go in the field for a day as well. Brilliant. And if you weren't riding for a living, what would be your dream job? I would probably run a bar. Um, as I'm quite social and um, I, I enjoy good food and drink so yes I would probably run a bar or a pub or something. What do you feed your horses to keep them in tip-top condition? I feed my horses Dodson and Horrell and have done for years. Brilliant and what's your favourite horsey product and why? My favourite horsey product would probably at the moment have to be the Sam Shield hat um, which I absolutely love. Um, it's a hat that, that manages to keep you cool, it looks glam, you can have bling on it. I'm a girl, I like a bit of bling. Um, and, and it's really lightweight and it's, it's taken a long time coming to have comfortable, comfortable, safe riding hats and they've done a fantastic job. Uh, what do you look for when buying a horse for dressage? I think it's a bit like fancying somebody buying a horse for dressage. You have to love the horse, it has to do something for you if you're going to keep the horse long term then then you have there has to be something about it that makes you connect with it a bit like um otherwise a bit like your mum trying to choose your boyfriend for you you they can find you this absolutely suitable you know right size and shape good job and, and, and all the credentials but you just don't fancy them it's a bit like that with horses people can ring you and say Anna I've got this horse it's this high it looks like this it moves like this and but you have to connect with it and that's really important brilliant and finally what one thing are you hoping to get for Christmas this year I can't it's so embarrassing I'll be honest with you I'm hoping to get that, that gadget that slices the thing into ribbons for my Maggi mix because <laughs> I'm a really clean cook and I want that thing that makes my courgettes come out in, in ribbons. <laughs> I'm being honest. <laughs>